All right, so I broke all of the clips for my GoPro. That's my all new ones, even the one that came with the damn thing I broke. I've been doing a lot of videos. I know I haven't been uploading them, but that's because, like I was saying in my Facebook post, I am expanding. I'm doing a lot more things. I have a lot more footage coming. And the quote of the days will be starting up. I don't think it's going to be an everyday thing. I think it's going to be uh, maybe just for the weekdays. Maybe I'll just lose my camera. Like I said, I have no clips, so if I turn, the camera's gonna be flying. All right, so expanding, doing a lot of new stuff, and I went into work last night. The whole point of this video is to tell you that, and I went into work last night after having two nights off. All right, and supposedly. I was fired on Thursday. I'm gonna hold the camera so I can turn. Wow, that's flying. At least it just landed in the seat. Kind of excited to see what happened. So, I was fired on Thursday of last week. Now, I didn't know this. No idea. So I went into work last night. And everyone kept asking me, I thought you were fired. sooner than later. All right, so I was fired. And everyone kept asking me why I was there. Like, well, why wouldn't I be here? Well, we heard you got fired. And I'm like, well, why would I be fired? And like, I don't know. Like, have I done anything wrong? I don't recall doing anything wrong. I'm like, well, we don't know. We just, that's what we heard. And that went on for a couple hours at the beginning of the night. Given I clocked in, there was no issues. Management didn't say anything. So I told management that I was kind of cracking up because everyone does, keeps telling me I was fired last week. They're like, well, we didn't hear anything. So it, it was uh, entertaining. Very entertaining. And then at the end of the night, I was in the back room taking some stuff back before clocking out, and the morning shift gets there at 5 o'clock now. So I was back there talking to the morning shift people, you know, just real quick, hey, how you doing and stuff. They're like, hey, Dustin, I thought you got fired. And I'm like, really? Considering the fact that a uh, uh, termination is confidential and no one would know until they're like, well, where's Dustin been? And no one can actually say, well, he got fired or anything. All they can say is that he doesn't work here anymore. Whether if I quit or got fired. Or whether if I were to move to another store, they technically are not allowed to say what happened to me. So I'm like, well, how the hell did everyone hear about me getting fired if, number one, I haven't been fired. And if they were going to fire me, they can't now. Because far too many people have heard about it. So... I guess the biggest thing is I got fired last week, but I'm still working. I think I need to find a new job. Because quite frankly, I'm not making any money doing anything else. I used to make some money doing some computer work for people, but I'm not, I just haven't done it. There's no, there's no work to be done. There's no money in it right now either. When you can buy a brand new laptop for 200 bucks, why are you going to pay someone to fix a computer that's really not worth fixing? I mean, if you have, like, some big expensive computer, chances are you have some sort of warranty on it. So, you don't have to worry about it. Long story short, I need a new job. Or I need to make this channel make me some money. But I don't think that's going to happen. Uh, however... If anyone knows of any jobs in my general area, which we, I'm only going to give you the area code, 13440, let me know. Full time's best, but you know, I guess at this point I just have to make sure to have a backup, just in case. Well, thanks for watching. Till next time, guys. Enjoy.